What the hell are you playing at, Ludwig? I've just been talking to Johnny. What do you mean? I mean all this poppycock about engineering and him getting a job. What do you think his parents will think? I haven't the foggiest. Johnny's parents are working people. His father's a miner. They sacrificed everything they have to get him to Cambridge. What's Johnny's parents got to do with it? Listen, Wittgenstein. Johnny's parents are workers. That's what you admire when it's confined to the pages of Tolstoy. I've never met Johnny's parents. I strongly advise you not to. You're foisting your own self-hatred onto their son. You've been reading Sigmund Freud. What of it? It's dangerous stuff. Believe me, it takes one Viennese to know another. Freud's nothing to do with Johnny sweating it out in some god-awful factory. You can't do this, Wittgenstein. You can't use Johnny as fodder for your own fantasies. What I do is none of your business. It's my business to stop you from, oh, what's your word, infecting too many young men. You have a terrible power over them, can't you see that? Half of Cambridge goes around imitating your mannerisms. You know I've never encouraged disciples. I'm talking about you, not your ideas. You lord it over others and you don't even know it. All aristocrats idealize the common folk, as long as they keep stoking the boilers. I should know. I was brought up like that, too. If you're talking about my upbringing, that was a long time ago, in another country. How can I possibly speak to a man who believes I corrupt others? I'm simply quoting your own words. Russell, I would like you to know that our friendship is now over.